your Storm Tracker Team forecast with Kevin Smith. Hey, good Wednesday morning, everyone. No rainfall this morning, but the rain chances will return in the seven day. I hate to say let's take a look live view one more time at that sky cam showing uh, nothing but that very chilly start across the area and indeed uh, make sure you bundle up this morning, but you really won't need that jacket later this afternoon. Those temperatures will top out into the 60s. We're currently at the airport 37 degrees. 34 and the ham and you travel up toward Kenwood with 36 37 new roads and 41. That's a little warmer if you want to call it that and to Lafayette. Now the reason for it, some dry air is filtering in the dew points currently at 36 degrees, 37 in the new roads. We have a dew point of 39 and Gonzalez, unlike those 60s that we saw yesterday morning. So what is happening right now? Nothing but high pressure. Now that storm system that brought us the rainfall yesterday morning is exiting toward the folks in Florida, extending up toward the eastern seaboard. But once again, high pressure building in from the west and then uh, across the western U.S. We have another storm system. This will start to affect us as we travel into your weekend into next week. So here we go with the forecast. There is that H. We're going to say uh, goodbye to that. That's going to be pushing off toward the east. And in doing so, that clockwise flow winds will turn around toward the south at 8 to 16 tomorrow. And you see this white. Those are some high clouds that will start to filter in. And mild conditions, temperatures back into the lower to the mid-70s. But for today, 65 degrees. Winds from the east-southeast at 4 to 8 miles per hour. This evening, we're driving it down to 44 under a mostly clear sky. So your seven-day forecast, temperatures back on the way up. Up, climbing to 75 on Friday. Rain chances at 10% with southerly flow, 20% on Saturday, increasing to 30% on Sunday. Weak front, actually a little bit of a stronger front, 72 to around 58 degrees. Then another front beyond Tuesday will knock us back into the 60s, back into the 50s. Overnight lows by that time will drop into the mid to upper 40s. Now we go toward the Skeeter meter, brought to us by Salvent. Now up to some moderate levels as we travel towards your Thursday, but back down to low levels on Friday. Meanwhile, we have those radio updates brought to us by iHeart Baton Rouge family. Let's take a look at what's happening along.